is one of the available heater and air conditioner panels for your vehicle. If your vehicle is equipped with a different heater and air conditioner system, see your owner's manual for additional information. This is the panel you'll use to set the heater and air conditioner system. Press this button to turn the system on. The indicator light will illuminate and the system will automatically regulate and maintain fan speed, airflow, and temperature in the cabin. Turn this dial to set the desired temperature. Turn this dial if you wish to set a separate temperature for the passenger side. If you wish to return to controlling the temperature with the driver's control, press the dual button. You can override the settings of the automatic heater and air conditioner system as needed. For example, you can use these buttons to adjust the fan speed up or down. Press this button to change the airflow mode. Your choice is shown on the display. The airflow can be set to the center and side vents, center and side vents and foot outlets, mainly from foot outlets, and from the defroster and foot outlets. Press this button to recirculate air inside your vehicle. This increases AC efficiency and helps block outside odors from entering the cabin. Press this button to draw in fresh outside air. The indicator light on the button for the active mode will illuminate. The recirculation mode cannot be activated when the heater and air conditioner system is in front defroster mode. However, recirculation mode can be activated while using the defroster and foot outlet mode. Allowing outside air to enter the vehicle further improves defogging performance. Press this button to manually turn the air conditioner on or off. In hot or humid conditions, a visible mist may be seen coming from the vents. This does not indicate a malfunction. You can return to automatic control of the heater and air conditioner system at any time by pressing this button. To defrost or defog front and side windows, press this button. The indicator light will illuminate and airflow will be directed to the front and side windows. The indicator light on the AC button may also illuminate because the AC compressor is activated to help dry the air and improve window clearing performance. The air can still be fully warmed with the AC activated. If the system is in dual mode, switching to defrost will automatically revert to driver temperature control so that both sides of the windshield defrost evenly. Align the left and right side vents to direct airflow towards the front side windows. Adjust the temperature to a setting that will best meet weather conditions. For windshield de-icing, set the temperature to maximum heat. Also, using the manual fan control, set the fan speed to high. If so equipped, press this button to defrost or defog the rear window and the outside mirrors. The indicator light will illuminate. Press again to turn off. If not turned off manually, this function will automatically deactivate in a period of time. There is a temperature sensor located on top of the dashboard near the windshield that helps regulate the automatic heater and air conditioner settings. Please keep this area clear of papers and other materials. Please see your owner's manual for important safety information, system limitations, and additional operating information.